Hi friends, welcome back to my channel. This is Taisha with Organized Plans. I want to start by thanking all of my returning subscribers for spending some time with me today. And if you're new to my channel and haven't subscribed yet, I would love to have you. In today's video, I'm going to be decorating my mini dashboard happy planner, which I use for social media planning. And this will be for the week of April 16th through the 23rd. So if you'd like to join me for this plan with me, then let's get started. Okay, so for this week's spread, I am going to be using the Happy Planner, um, the Zay Wild Painted Blossom sticker book. I got this sticker book a while ago and actually have never used it before. So I thought um, this would make a great spread. I did a flip through of it and it has pretty much everything in the one sticker book. And I really have been enjoying trying to use just one sticker book um, in my spreads recently. So this has got functional stickers and decorative stickers that I think this one is going to be fun to use and some pretty florals as well that I think are perfect for spring. Um, so I grabbed this sticker book and I just kind of went through my washi stash and these are all I think Happy Planner washies um, and I think uh, just decide on which one I want to go with as we get going with everything. So we will start by just pulling the pages off the disc and uh, get going with planning. All right, so just put that to the side and take a sticky note off. All right, so I have some wax paper here and we'll just start by pulling um, some stickers and see kind of what will work for us. And I think I'm just gonna zoom us in just a touch. Okay, there we go. All right, so I did, as I said, a flip through. I believe this sticker book is still available on the happyplanner.com um, website. This may also be available at Michael's or Joann's. Um, so this is a, a great one. I love the rose gold in here. Um, and I wanted to go with... Uh, just do a kind of a quick flip through of everything. Really um, soft pastels, I think I love this. So it was kind of this set here that has the different um, florals and kind of purple and um, peach kind of color. So this is what I wanna go with. Um, this really pretty like olive green. So I think this is gonna work really well for this week. Okay, um, so this is the set that I want to start with and I know I like to have kind of a long box um, that I'll put in so let me just grab that sticker and then this one here grow today I think that's quite fitting for how I use this planner and um, you know the the dashboard planner is quite functional I think it works really well so as I said, I'm using this for social media planning, planning but um, even if I wasn't doing this with you know YouTube and Instagram and everything, I think this is still such a great layout for so many different uses. So, um, so hopefully this will give you some inspiration. Um, but I did like this grow today. As I said, I think this is pretty fitting for, you know, just growing my channel and everything. So, and I just love this, I guess, um, cow <laughs> with the flowers on top. Oh, that is so sweet. All right. Um, and I don't know, these are kind of drawing my eye as well. These pretty florals. And I think it matches so well. So maybe we'll just um, grab a few of these and kind of bring them around the page. Let's see how we want to use them. And then like these blue ones, the blue is really pretty as well. Okay, so just trying to collect the stickers so we can, so I don't have to flip back and forth too much. 
Um, and I think I want to bring in, as I said, I love this like olive green color. Um, and I spotted these circle ones as well. Uh, so let's see. I think I want to do the noted. I'll grab that one. I like these florals. These are a little bit smaller. This kind of light bouquet here. Just grab another piece. Um, there is magic in every day. I really like that. Okay. And then we have a little bit smaller floral. Okie dokie. All right. And I think I wanted um, to use some of the rose gold here as well because um, depending on which washi I go with, I think it'll be good to bring in some of these as kind of just headers, stickers, and then kind of the box here as well. So that probably will get us started. So I'm just gonna put this off to the side um, and then just start with just widening out these headers here. I typically um, don't use these in this way, so I'll just white these out. Okie dokie. And uh, this quote here at the bottom, Happy is, happiness is not a journey, it's a destination, that's nice. Okay, so I did notice, I feel like this washi, um, I don't know, I think I'm not gonna do the polka dot. I, I think I like the, uh, I think I like this one here, um, the stripe with the rose gold. Uh, so why don't we start with just putting that at the bottom of the page. I may use both of those washies, the floral one and the um, stripe rose gold one. So we'll just start with just putting that down just to give us a little bit of a border. Okay, I'm gonna cover up that white out. Um, and then I want to just take this and this long box and just kind of line it up here. Hopefully I'll put that down straight. Okay. Um, and I'm debating. Okay, actually I think that could work. So I like the llama too, <laughs> but I don't think I wanna bring the llama in. So I think I'm gonna just kinda of cover it up with this sticker, this Grow Today. I think that's okay. Let's see, I did not put that down straight, so let's just try that again, uh, just to kind of cover the llama up. And this book has got a few different themes in it, so I can maybe use the llama in the future. Okay, so like that a lot. Okay, it's a good start for us. And then definitely wanna bring that in. So I'm thinking to kind of have it sitting. Um, I think we're gonna need a longer box. So let's just kind of a longer box, like one of these, but they have the lines in them. Um, maybe what we'll do, let's not worry about the lines. Um, okay. Uh, let's see here. Let's see. I think I'm going to see if I can find a rose gold box that's a little bit longer so let me just pause for a minute okay friends i am back i found this uh a plain 
a rose gold foil box. Um, this one actually out of the Happy Planner colorful boxes mega um, sticker book. This is always um, a great one for all different kinds of colored boxes. So I think that is gonna work. And uh, so we'll go ahead and place this here. And then what I wanna do is kind of like this on top. And I'm just going to trim this just to make it a little bit more um, even of an edge there. Okie dokie. All right, super cute. Love that. Okay. So I think that will get us going with everything. Um, and I may, I think I want to just bring this in as well. What I tend to use these boxes for on the left hand side of the page is for um, noting my like subscriber growth, um, kind of putting down key tasks that I want to accomplish, um, important stuff, and then my YouTube task. Um, and so I love that. I think this looks so cute, um, really pretty. Okay, and then we'll just have that um, box just kind of overlapping with um, with those with that quote. So I think that's fine. And now on to the right side of the page. Um, I do use this box up here for my YouTube schedule of my different video um, posts for each day. Um, I have been pretty much posting about um, five at least videos a week, sometimes six videos, and I'm really enjoying it so much. So um, thanks everyone for all your continued support and, you know, comments and feedback. It definitely is uh, means so much to me. So um, thank you there. And um, I think what I want to do is have this quote and... I think I will put this here. I wanna just make sure I have enough room to still write. So if I put that here, then I can probably do washi here. Um, I like to sometimes do diagonal and I think that will work. So let's go ahead and, and try this washi out. This particular um, role came out of the newest squad um, goals or girls um, set. This was part of one of the Black Friday deals um, and it had maybe five or six different washi rolls in it. And I love Happy Planner washi. Um, and I think this matches so well. So it has these really pretty soft florals. Um, pattern in the design. Um, so we'll put a piece here. And then I think I want to do a piece here. And then some more at the bottom of the page. So we'll just fill that in. All right. And then last at the bottom. And then we'll kind of fill in as well with a few more of these um, boxes and stickers and so forth to bring some of that other color onto the page here. So if you have um, a dashboard planner, definitely would love to hear in the comments how, how you're using yours. Um, and I know I did get another one um, as part of the spring release, so cannot wait for July so I can start using that. Um, okay, so we'll kind of put this, I was thinking about maybe, because I want to use this bouquet somewhere. Um, 
And I want to use the quote too. <laughs> I don't know if I'll have enough room for it. Okay, so let's put this here at least. Okay, there is magic in every day. And then I think I want to, I want to use that bouquet, but I may not have enough room for it. Um, I did pull some of these florals as well. And just debating. Uh, it may be too big. Because I could just do half of it right here. I think we'll I think we'll do that. Put it right to the edge and then trim it down. Okay. Just make sure. Okay, so that looks good. And then I think maybe a piece up here at the top, just to kind of have that floral just using the other half of the sticker and putting that up here. Yeah, this is just such a really soft and really pretty um, spread for this week. So. I think this is going to work. Um, and let's see if there are any kind of bullet points in here. Oh, actually some flags. So that could work for me. Um, and let's just kind of do a quick flip through and see if there are any. There are some checklists. Um, I was just looking at the colors here, if I wanted to bring any of those colors in. Um, maybe this, maybe these, the tan, yeah. Okay, so let me pull the tan. It's kind of like an olive green tan. And I'm just looking to see if there are any bullet points. If not, okay, we have these, but I think they're a little too dark. So I think we'll just go with, with these here. So um, I'll look to uh, maybe bring in a box here. And then uh, one down here. And then finally, um, just a couple of these flags. I like to have something on each day just to kind of notate my Instagram post. So we'll do that one there, here. And uh, maybe one at the top. Okay. And See if I can just put that down a little bit straighter. Okay, that works. So I think this has come together really well. Um, I love it. Just that touch of rose gold. I know um, some planners don't like to use the foil just for how they how it shows up in the pictures, but I don't mind it too much. I love <laughs> the foil, especially rose gold. So I'm just going to go for it. Um, let me just straighten this one out. Just a touch. Okay. So I think that's going to do it um, for this week for this plan with me. Thank you all so much for watching. And if you like this video, definitely give me a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and drop me a comment down below and let me know what you think. Thanks again for watching and I hope you have a great day. Bye friends.